Whiskey, man. Whiskey had to cancel his shows, bruv. Or rather, his tour. He cancelled it? Yeah. Mm. No, wait, the whole tour that's going to go run mm. from... Cancelled, bro. I saw that. I saw that, bro. The tour is cancelled, bro. I'm surprised that you didn't see that. No. Because I thought that, that's like the done tour. deal, isn't it? Like, it, it's cancelled. The, the new dates are going to come out. All right. Yeah, the new dates are going to come out. Wait, I believe I saw that somewhere. Let me just double check real quick. I think if there's no other other, other reason, then it's just bowing, bowing to pressure, bruv. Whiskey has pushed back his planned North, North America tour in support of more due to what the singer described as unforeseen circumstances. Yeah, they must be... Because mm-hmm. they came from him because he was promoting the whole tour thing, the midst of this whole thing. That is, I don't think, I, I don't think that that would be the reason why, why yeah. the tour is cancelled. Yeah, that is. What do you think? You, you think the, the, is, the sales are not going good? That's what a lot of people are saying. Mm. Mm. That's what a lot of people are saying. That is probably tickets. That he's not selling out. Selling as, out tickets like they expect they it. We don't know, but that's, that's, that's what, but that's. What a lot of people are saying, and when I look at the whole thing, what exactly would make him push back the dates? I wish he could come out and clear it up, but we all know whiskey is not really the talking he's not, type he's like not that. Do that. But are, are, are all the venues like 10 10,000 10, 10, over capacity or what? They're, they're smaller venues, isn't it? I, f- On I, the tour. I, I don't know, I, di- I didn't go into details like that, I didn't really check it's it. It's not all. Because I'm trying to see if he's struggling to sell tickets there. I mean, they're not all like 20,000 20, capacity, all of it. Like all the venues is going to be playing. Mm. They're smaller venues. Smaller like, yeah, ones. Yeah, yeah. Not so, all of them would be like massive, massive venues. I'm like actually that. looking at Billboard right now. That's the source. And Billboard says, Whiskey pushes North American more love, less ego tour to fall 2023. Whiskey has pushed, planned, um, pushed back his planned North America tour in support of more love, less ego, on the eve of his kick-off due to what the singer described as unforeseen circumstances. The album, because I remember, I remember vividly well that DJ Tune posted on his Instagram story when they were getting into the plane and he said, more love, less ego tour, you know, starting soon or whatever, boom, boom. So they were flying out mm. just before the elections. Mm. You get what I'm saying? And that was the reason why I was surprised during the elections he was in Ghana. Yeah. You know what I mean? So I think they probably came back. Then this news came out. You get know what I'm saying? And it says um, the outing was slated to begin on Friday, the third of March, at the Toyota Center in Houston. Toyota Center is big. Yeah. That that's like the O2. You get know what I'm saying? And um, would have kept the Afrobeat star on the road through a May 28 gig at the London Paul Park in Miami. So they are not saying the reason yeah. why the the M tour was was moved, but yeah, maybe the mm. organizers are you know because it's not just him; it's he's got loads of partners. Maybe partners you know, and, they're yeah, not ready yeah. to go. Yeah. If I mean, if your guys them are not ready to go, I know whiskey is big, but you didn't get Ogama. Mm. So if your guys are not ready to go, then it's a no, no. We do you feel that there, that there's a chance where the tickets are, are not selling? There is always a chance. Yeah, yeah of man. course. There is always Even a with with every artist, like it's not it's not always there. You can do one show and then sell out. It's it's mm-hmm. not easy. You do when you when it's a tour, bro. It even happened to him in Ghana. Yeah. Oh yeah, in December. In December. And yeah, he, yeah, but the December one was, was not really his fault though. I'm not saying it was his fault. Okay. I'm just saying he didn't turn up because yeah, tickets didn't. didn't sell as much. Yeah. So he didn't turn up. I think something is happening with whiskey, bro. Is that why he didn't turn up? Well, that was people a are just saying. That people was a are rumor. Just, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was, was a rumor. But that was the most logical reason ar- surrounding the circumstances. Like, think, do you get what I'm trying yeah, to say? But I think, yeah, I think part of the reason why he probably didn't turn up for that Ghana one, yeah, is when I look at the show that Bonaboy did in Lagos mm. with the whole sound thing and everything, yeah. which he talked about on stage, I think they have a clause on their contract saying, listen, if you don't do this, do this, do this, do this, do this, if you break any of this, um, I have the right to to pull up. Yeah, mm. 
They always I think do. so. Yeah, they always. Yeah, do. they think, always do. I yeah, think they, enough. they yeah, probably yeah. would have something like that in their contract. If you are. But he didn't even come out with any explanation whatsoever to say. Do you get what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. but because uh, usually, if 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 it's to do with that, no, 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 no. But he said he released a statement though. Did he? Yes, he yeah, released he a statement. Be, I remember video. Well. Was, week, was it statement. weeks after then? No, nah, no, no, it no, was no, immediately. No, no, no. He said we're going to do another show. Another another okay. date is coming. Okay. Yes, okay. yes. He, show. I remember now. He released a statement saying that I can something like I cannot chip change my fans and everything. They deserve the best show. Mm. Boom, boom, boom. Like he kind of tiptoed around it. He didn't really go into details. Mm. He gave me, but from what he was saying, if I read it, he's saying, hey. These guys, they were not, not ready for me. They yeah. were not ready. They didn't do what they were supposed to do. Okay, you got me. I remember following that 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 um thingy and everything. But then, I mean, it's unfortunate with the North American tour tour um thingy, bro. Yeah, you get what I'm saying. God damn. But there, there are loads of reasons why they will push it back. Like there's loads. Obviously, tickets ticket sales is up there, but there's there's loads of other reasons why it will be pushed back. Yeah, but people were laughing at man though. Laughing at him. Yeah, he's, he's always going to have haters. People are laughing Yo, against him. Like, I've never seen nothing like this, bro. A lot of people don't like that dude. But it's love. You know, you know, Nigeria, there's this camp mentality thing where if you're, if you're a fan of this person, you have to hate the other yeah. person. If you're yeah. a fan of that person, you have to hate the other person. I For hate some that weird shit. reason now, I think Davido is kind of becoming the golden child now again. Do you not think it's because, because people... Because, because, you know what? I feel like it's, it's, it's more sympathetic you're probably right because of his... Um, yeah. 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 I think it's more sympathetic than anything else right now. Because a lot of people were like putting up a, um, a petition now. Yo, we need you to come back to social media with me still. Mm, boom, boom, boom. Mm, mm. Because he's been quiet. Because you know, yeah, he's and you know, proud to that, he was, yo, David doing a social media king. Like he's always on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter. He's always out there posting. He's always posting. Yeah, but I, I think what other thing is, he's a very likable guy. I think we've said it on the pod. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Out of three of them, now who would you who do you think you're gonna vibe with the most? Like the most? Davido. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me too, Davido. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it's just that kind of guy where yeah, yeah. you you kind of even though yeah you it be billionaire son or whatever, but you kind of true you true, would relate true, to true, yeah you would true, relate true. to his vibe yeah. big time. True, I think that's true, just where he's true, always true. been that guy. Yeah. Pe- people like him. People just like the guy. 